Introducing two new electronic torque wrenches from GearWrench, the 3 8 inch drive 85076 and the half inch drive 85077. These new electronic torque wrenches make extremely accurate tightening easy because their flashing visual and beeping audible alerts let you know before you reach the target point. So there's less chance of over torquing faster and the vibrating handle confirms you've reached the torque setting. Electronic torque wrenches are different from beam and micrometer style torque wrenches and weighs many techs by useful. They're more accurate. These new gear wrench models are plus or minus 2% accurate in clockwise rotation and plus or minus 3% counterclockwise. They're more versatile. They switch from foot-pounds to newton meters to inch-pounds and more at the touch of a button. Different scales don't require different wrenches. There's no unwinding after each use. Since they're electronic, not mechanical, there's no need to reset the spring back to its at-rest position. You simply switch the power off. They're more resistant to low-level shock. Even slight impacts can destroy the calibration on micrometer torque wrenches. Minor shocks generally do not affect electronic torque wrenches. But probably the biggest reason why electronic torque wrenches are gaining in popularity is their ease of use. Setup is quick and tightening fasteners to the correct torque is easier, so you can get more done in less time. Here's how easy it is to use the new electronic torque wrenches from GearWrench. First, press the power button to turn the wrench on. The numeric display will appear. It's important you don't apply any torque pressure to the wrench during setup. Select your preferred unit of measurement by scrolling through your choices using the unit button. These new wrenches offer five choices. Foot-pounds, newton-meters, or inch-pounds are the most popular. Your choice will stay in the wrench memory until you change it. Now you can set your target torque. Press the set button. Scroll up or down to get the right torque. Then press set again to lock in your choice. Again, this number will stay in the wrench memory until you change it. You've selected your unit of measurement and target torque. So now you get to decide how close to the target torque you want the flashing LED and audible beep alerts to start. This is called the target torque alert, and there is no correct setting. It depends on your personal preference and working style. For example, if your target torque is 80 foot-pounds and you want the alerts to start when you're halfway there at 40 foot-pounds, you simply set the target torque alert to 50%. But if you don't want the visual and audible alerts to start until you're much closer to your target torque, you might select 25%. Then the alerts won't start until you hit 60 foot-pounds. Set the target torque alert by first pressing the percent button. Using the up or down arrow key, scroll to the target torque alert you prefer. Then press the percent button again to lock in your choice. Now you can go to work. Here we've set our target torque to 75 foot-pounds with the torque alert at 50%. As the target torque is approached, the visual and audible alerts begin. Once the target has been reached, both alerts turn continuous and the handle vibrates. The 3 8 and half inch drive electronic torque wrenches come with a gear wrench one year limited warranty and a 90 day calibration guarantee. Gear wrench helps you get it done.